Hey what's up guys welcome to Fine Gap YouTube channel and in today's video we will learn about how you can create and use cards inside your Android user interface so guys video is going to more important and please before start i request you to subscribe our youtube channel to stay up to date with amazing programming videos and in this video again i want to tell you we are going to learn how you can create beautiful cards inside your android studio let's start okay guys here you can see that i have created a new android studio project to use cards inside your android studio we had to add a new dependency inside our build load gradle file at this position so open google and search here card view dependency open the first link which is official website of android developer and uh, uh, scroll down here you can see that this is the dependency uh, we have to copy this dependency and open your android studio and paste it at this position and uh, now we have to click on sync now button so you can see that our dependency has been added to our android studio now we will design our user interface using card layout so open the main activity and here first of all i am going to remove this text view and i have to use a view here view uh, guys make this is not the card view uh, its width would be mesh parent and height would be 200 dp forward slash and here you can see that our view is created we have to constrain it horizontally and constrain it to the top of our parent and i'm going to choose its background color to purple 700 so this is just our background and now we have to add a card view card view so you can see that android studio is giving you suggestion just just double click on this and it's uh, it's uh, width would be match parent height would be 80 dp and uh, we have to close this one so here you can see that this is our card view and uh, we have to constrain it uh, at this point and constrain its bottom again at this at this point and constrain it horizontally at as well and now we have to give some margin like 24 dp from right and from left as well so guys you can see that here is our simple card view now we have to do something uh, important first of all i'm going to choose its height to from 80 to 100 dp and uh, now suppose you want to give uh, a corner radius to your card how you will do that you just have to type one property corner radius uh, 8 dp so you can see that guys our card corner radius uh, have been added successfully and one important thing suppose you want to add a shadow to your card again you have to just add a one property which is card elevation you just have to type here card elevation 8 dp so guys the more you will increase this number the more your shadow will be increased so guys here you can see that a beautiful shadow have been appeared to the outside of our card view and now suppose i want to add uh, some views in our card view i just have to add first of all a view group like i'm going to add relative layout and its width would be match parent height would be match parent and guys now i'm going to type a text view here height would be wrap content width would be wrap content and uh, android colon text uh, is uh, fine gap okay center in parent true text size uh, would be 18 dp that's it guys so guys here you can see that by using this technique you can add any element or any view inside your card view and to increase our current user interface over our main activity i just have to add one text view text view and uh, constraint horizontally and also constraint it to the top and i'm going to give margin top 50 dp text color would be white text size would be 30 sp text style would be bold and text would be so here i have to type the text uh, card view example so guys now you can see that our user interface is looking a little bit good so guys i hope you enjoyed this video a lot and please subscribe to our youtube channel to stay up to date with amazing programming videos and share this video with your those friends who want to learn android apps development and finally thanks for watching